aces. This is this is a really annoying size where he could just easily have aces. But I can't fold his king suited. Uh Sir? And fall back kings. This guy looks pretty snug. Uh, so here we actually go for the lead. Uh, and then I'm going to back turn and bluff a load of rivers. Fuck. I kind of didn't want to see this, to be honest. Yeah. This guy's an absolute stain. Well, I've not run kings into aces in a while. So, yeah. Um, we'll just tug him as a tramp. And he's pretty sick as well because queens, I, I, I unironically fold queens. Versus that four bet, especially when he just snap clicks like that. So, all right, at least uh, we've run kings into aces at two hundred and not at one k. Touch wood before I jinx myself for tomorrow if I play, but only with like really high equity bluffs, which don't really count as bluffs when you just have like a ton of equity against like everything. Uh, this really sucks here, but I think we just have to go with it when this guy is cold called. With his size in, he shouldn't really have aces either. So worst case scenario should be kings, but famous last words. <laughs> what a tramp. Ran into aces twice, nice. Club, do it! Club! I deserve it for that retarded size. <laughs> oh my god, get fucking wrecked, son! Get fucking wrecked! The heater is on, boys. The heater is on. Okay, this for a spot to squeeze there. Don't have aces. Because, like, if he has aces, can I even complain after that? Oh, my God. Right, you don't have aces. This is, this is a really annoying size where he could just easily have aces. But I can't fold his king to it. Uh, sir? Sir? Just a bit of a call of that, to be fair. Sometimes you got the ace king, sometimes you got the queen five. What the fuck is happening today? We call the three bets, blind versus blinds. We have got second pair. Oh my god, I'm so good at this game. This guy just three bet the button, and I had jacks in the small blind, and I just folded. Uh, someone opened he three back button versus MP and I just folded and he had aces. Probably calling twice here with this combo and then having a hard time on river. There's a world where I call river. How about the Jack of Diamonds? Jack, buddy. Does he ever shove King Tan? Ace King? Oh my god, I just called a check raise there and drilled it so fucking hard on the turn. Such a fucking retarded turn bet, like... So, I, I, it's funny as well, if he shoves river, so fucking age. Yeah, just bet every single thing you've got on the turn. Why not? Uh, he's polar on flop, so he can have, like, ace ten and stuff, which never folds, even versus big size, so... Need the board to not power on river. You can have King Jack suited as well. You should have, should have two suits of King Jack. He might even have all combos of King Jack. So he should only have Ace King here. King Queen should probably fold turn. He's not really going to turn into an, anything into a bluff here either. So yeah, we just chop basically always. I would imagine. Yep. <sighs> Nice, uh, nice dunk shove on the river. I'm going to call you with so many hands that are worse because you literally just can't have bluffs though. You never, ever have bluffs. Speaking of bluffs, I got five high. What a fucking retarded size. 42 big blinds versus six. Yeah, sure. Got five high, you dope. Um, I can block here, I guess, or check call. Block and then just side call and lose. With a spade. Unless he shoves. I might fold versus shove. Yep. 
Uh, we three bets here. I'm gonna check back. I'm on a, I'm on an eleven, so I'm gonna check back on this flop with this hand. Be nice in disguise if we ever drill it. Um, and he overbats, which is pretty retarded, but just be the nine of hearts one time. Oh, nine of spades. You love to see it. How much do you love to see that? How much do you love to see it, boys? You love to see it. You love to see it. Probably chopping. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing, lad? <laughs> okay. Do you know why he's done that as well? Hello, you're in the stream, aren't you, buddy? Because I had him as the nit tag. I knew he was going to get out of line. Compared to Denmark, anyway. That's top set, isn't it? Right, what kind of play am I against? Whenever you're in a hand, by the way, I think the first thing you should consider when you're like three bat and you've got this hand, don't consider ranges, but like, right, what kind of player am I against? I'm going to bet small here. I would check this back against good rags. That's a really shit turn. It could be a really good turn. It could be a really shit turn. Uh, he could even have queens here as well. We're still going to play for stacks, but he has four combos of King Jack here, pure, that will always take this line, I would imagine. That's actually the fucking best river ever. Does he have Queen 10? There's Queen 10 of... No, we block Queen 10. So I have Queen Jack. Ace Jack off. Okay. Thank you, sir. So bad it's funny. You're not wrong. <laughs> what are you doing leading this turn, you dickhead? For this size. So I'm actually going to raise here. But he could have a deuce because this guy is a net. But he shouldn't really be leading that size with a deuce. The question is, can I go for value on the river? Yeah, this is... I'm not going to check this back, am I? How tight is this guy? Okay. Uh, three bet small blinds versus... Uh, I have to bet this turn because there's so much that calls us worse. But when he shoves, we're going to be dead sometimes, which is going to fucking suck balls. Do I want to check this rover now? Yeah, I think I check. With diamonds. He's never going to call that ace, queen of clubs and stuff. Probably not going to bluff it, but... I think he might just have nines. I wonder if he ever bluffs. Just bluff like queen, jack of clubs. Just shove queen, jack of clubs, you're funny. Or queen, jack of spades, which is better, because you block more king x that way. Pocket nines. <laughs> I saw aces and I was like, oh, well, he wins, doesn't he? Like, <laughs> but like, no, he doesn't. Oh, get wrecked, sir. Oh, mate, you love to see it. You love to fucking see it. The problem is what I'm upset about there is that I like I, I've not seen a bluff and I really want to see him bluff a river. I want to see him put his big boy pants on and bluff a fucking river. I'm not seeing him bluff a river ever. I'm trying to give him all the opportunity. Like even when he shoves, he said like even when we win. We can have fun here. I'm on a low roll, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna just call. But we can definitely fall about this when we're deep. Don't like not having a club, but we won't fold to one bat. I am gonna bat here. Still have nines and eights and stuff. It calls. It's worse. Look at this, I have to flap this river because of his stats. We might lose here. <laughs> Imagine only getting that much value. <laughs> can just tell when people are going to have it, man. I don't think he bluffs that and he never value. I, I think he checks back sets as well. Yeah, deep here. Ooh, thinking of a turn card dealer. Oh, it's, it's absolutely not that one. Um, a queen's actually not a nutted out, which is a shame. Do I still call versus this size? Yeah, I call versus this size and then I bluff on clubs versus check as well. Ugh.
I'm so fucking glad he bat. I'm so glad he bat because I was thinking of doing something extremely silly, boys. I've got nine high, sir. So. Uh, with three bats, guy calls. What a fucking turn card that is. Are you fucking joking? I just flopped 98% equity. I just turned 95% equity and did not win. Go and absolutely fuck yourself in the anus. Are we going to go for the check raise? Yes, we are. It depends on size. It's a large bat. Still going to check raise. And we'd be blasting on like a nine and shit as well. Maybe a... Maybe a... Okay, well, it's a nine of hearts. I'd, I'd do some checking on um on some heart turns, but this one brings in straights for us as well. So I'll bet here. And then we'll cry when he's got the nuts. It's just so obviously the nut flush, but I guess I'm not doing anything else. What else could he have? Could he have like queen ten of hearts here? Probably, but I don't think he will. What was he ever start to bluff here? Ace King with the Ace of Hearts, I guess. We we'll just call in and call him River. But would not surprise me if we see the nuts just somehow have a bluff. A bluff! What an adult! You get the adult tag. Look at him. Grown up. Absolute grown up. Tens we flop us that. Nice board for tens. Uh, do I ever have like small bets here? I think we still just do this. Hit a nine, that'd be cool. It's unlikely he's going to have nine X then. I guess he can have some nine X of diamonds. Well, that's a great river, isn't it? What a good river that is. Yeah, we're going for three streets with A's turn. Yeah, nice river. What a fucking absolutely retarded run out, bro. Look at the fucking percent that I am on the flop with that hand. Uh, amazing flop. Uh, if he has queen, if he has a queen, it doesn't count, right? As a uh, bad beat. Just gonna bet that shove here. Yeah. I really don't know what to do here. <laughs> Such a weird turn. Why are you shoving? <laughs> Wait, I can chop here. Can you imagine I chop? That'll be the worst bad beat ever. Wow. Is everything okay? What is this run out, man? I check call flop, check call turn. What is that fucking river? Jesus Christ. All right, that was a very, very kind gift. That was a very, very nice gift. Gonna have to run this, unfortunately. Ace, queen, off suit. Ew. Gonna run things once today. See if we can run good. Bit of nice queen of diamonds. Womp womp. That uh, that ace king hand was a classic case of me being uh, me forgetting of what stakes I'm playing. <coughs> basically, that's a set of queens and a three bet pot. That is a fucking amazing turn. <clears throat> Unless he has like aces and no spared. Queen and let him have kings. <laughs> what is that river? 
What the fuck is that river? This is twice I've flopped a fucking flopped a set and end up losing the hand. I don't think we can win here. Does he ever do this with Queen X, like Ace Queen? There's a chance. This is so retarded. The quarter part will call. So retarded, man. Finally got a hand in a splash part. What am I going to do here, then? Um, I don't really like overlimping when somebody's already limped. So I guess we'll go something like this. If he'd have folded, I would have limped. A uh, pretty reasonable flop. I don't think he had, should have that many 6x for... Um, we can go about 15 here. The limp call in. Uh, I'm just going to show the term of this SPR. I don't really know what he should be having here. Can have some like nine ten suitors and shit. Seven should just limp shove, but we get snap. That's really not ideal. Seven six suited. Go fuck yourself, Jack. Come on, what the fuck is this, Jack? So AIDS, man. Yeah, just limp call twenty bigs with seven six and flop me fucking basically dead. Okay then. Squeeze in the ace king here. Expect us to go fold call pretty often. I uh, wasn't expecting to see this running it, but I won't be happy if it's aces. Of course it is. Of course it's fucking aces. When do I ever, as well, run aces into like ace king or kings? It just doesn't fucking happen anymore. Uh, three bet here. I think this is a reasonable hand to see bet. Block ace queen suited. The seven doesn't really improve him. What's the jack? Like? I don't think I want to check this hand too often. I think I'll barrel and then probably shove on a spade. Uh, not the ten of spades. Uh, ten percent bet, and then very, 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 very side shove. So we shouldn't have king jack at all. He shouldn't really have sixes, but I think this is a a good spot to ten percent, and then we kind of have to call with a spade in our hand. So, 10% fold with Jack with no spade, 10% call with Jack with a spade. Thing is, I don't think he'll bluff all that often. That's the only problem. But he doesn't have that many flushes with us having the Jack and the 10 being there. Like, ace-9 of spades. So fucking sick, man. Obviously, he's just a whopper playing 9-6 suited. Such a shit... Such an unbelievably unfair run out, man. Spots like that, it's so unbelievably unfair. Like, it has to come a spade and then the ten of spades. So it's getting one outward and then some. Fuck me, man. I'm gonna be all in here. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna ram this in. We uh we called uh, uh in a spot with uh six seven off suit in a splash pot. And uh, I called four shoves with 6-7 offsuit <laughs> and beat aces, king jack. I won a 1k splash bot last week because I'm Twitter. Retarded. Absolutely retarded. Uh, yeah. Bat, bat. I'll need it if we're going to get those retarded runouts. What's going to happen here? The three of hearts and he have a fluff? Uh, I don't know how often he bets Queen X here anyway, so I might end up chat calling. Probably just chat call the turn, but... Um, really annoying spot. I guess he has some 3X, but not really that many. Blocking 7-8 is pretty important. I don't think he overbets anything that isn't a straight. If he does, then I guess we'll play to him. So I'm going to call this. I think this is a good call with a 7 in a hand and not having a heart, so... He doesn't bluff better, so it's not like he's going to bluff sevens, I would assume, because there's no point. So he's polar here between 3x, and the only, he's got some 3x suited, and then pocket threes, that's about it. So I think this is a good hand to call with. Just have a bluff for once. Thank you. Thank you. Blocking 7-8 is pretty big there. So, massive. Look at this adult. Mother Teresa. Who, who knew Mother Teresa was a fucking adult? 
Picking up the aces. Why is why is that not correct? What's going on here? Uh, I could flat here. No, I'm on a high roll, so I'm not going to flat. I think flatting's pretty cool. Uh, not going to flat here. Going to four bets. Uh, I flat ace-king out the small blind. I don't really know why, but I flopped pretty fucking well. Egregiously well. How about that flop with this hand as well? That'd be cool. Uh, basically is, which is nice. I am just going to range bet this for really small. Take it down. It could probably go smaller than that. Here, I'm just going to, I'm going to check to the river. Hopefully there's some queen jack or like... <gasps> Hopefully there's ace 10. Oh my god, ace 10 would be the bad beat jackpot, right? Or ace queen, but I don't think he really ever has ace queen. Have ace 10. He doesn't have ace 10. He's got eight high and get... What the fuck are you checking the river for? What, are you six years old? Honestly, what, what the fuck was that? You're getting the adult tag taken away from me. I'm not having that. Eight high. <laughs> There's me. Have ace 10. <laughs> Eight high. Yeah, same thing. Uh, check raising hit. Boom. Uh, hopefully he has pocket twos here. I don't really think anyone's going to three bet fold the flop. So we just shove. Um, ah, it's cut off though. He's, I think he might have nines. But nines is more likely to call. So uh, We're going to go for the shove and expect to see a call. Ooh. You really gonna three bet fold? Aces, okay. Um, okay then. No ace, no spade. Or oh, apparently no turn and river. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Standard Friday, man. Standard fucking Friday. So fucking real. I have one out. Literally have one fucking out. So retarded, man. I better get a GG thanks GG thing as well, because that's fucking so retarded, man, honestly. Alright, gives a gives a nice flop before five suited. Nice flop for range. I'm gonna bet a lot to you. This hand, I'm definitely gonna bet flop. I might bet turn and I might bet river. Yeah, fuck it, I'm tripling. Triple in the old five high. So we can still have some like um, ace jack and some clubs and stuff like that. Uh, I mean, I'm still banging it in here. Uh, my four is basically never good. Sometimes it is. You can have some like ace king and stuff. But uh, I would imagine this is going to be pretty much a pure bluff. So we will check the spot. And show. I don't think I want to have sizes other than shove. So we'll just shove. And he's got nine seven somehow on calls, which is nice. Um, that hand definitely does want a three bet. I'm, I I don't know if he's gonna be a rag. He might just be a fish. This is a problem. You don't really know. Um, but his hand is definitely GTO approved. So I like it. <laughs> just like unbelievably retarded spots every time how does he have nine seven there how many how many times do you find people that are gonna have nine seven i, I actually think i need to see check here or some just absolute random bluff i guess he should have like 10 nine and 10 jack like i'm not folding a queen but like i guess he just has sevens of course he fucking does this is absolutely insane this does not happen to other people i don't give a fuck in 20 minutes of a stream they don't just lose four buy-ins to everything that has just happened like, the, 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 the chance of, of what's just happened in 20 minutes to happen in 20 minutes is just so... It's fucking negligible, I swear. Whoops. Second off of that is king against an unknown. We're flipping. I'm going to run things once. Can we win a flip, at least? <laughs> it's just... I'm like four by, like I'm nearly five buy-ins down in a fucking, in literally 25 minutes, which is just obscene. Unless we hit a jack, which would be a really nice way to moan it in, but something tells me it's not going to be one. Of course it's not. Honest to God. Happens to everyone. Happens to everyone. Everyone tunes in and loses five buy-ins in 30 minutes.
to just pure bullshit. Every single streamer. Happens to everybody. Of course it fucking does. Range about that bar. Um, here, I'm gonna bet turn and then check every river. Um, we beat the queen town. Uh, just fall about shoving kings here. Super weird one here. We three bet, we bet flop. Turn gives us. I mean, you could probably range back this for a small size, but it doesn't really work in terms of value. And the problem is, do I really want to call turn and river? Okay, he needs just a five. I swear to fucking God. I, I, unironically, I think that would have been better to, um, I think that would have been better to see a five for content sake. Because that, that would have just made it like the worst 30 minute run of Twitch poker, with the exception of maybe Eastie's run that he had that one time. I was, can I shove here? Just have a shove. I'm in the mood for it. I've got a good feeling about this one. I think we're going to get called and win. I don't know if I ever shoves. I don't want to fall about fold. Because when we're in position against him, he's going to have a lot of five bet shoves. So I don't know if it's a thing, but. This is a ridiculously good turn. I bet flop small, which I'm not really sure about. I guess don't want to over bet the eight. Especially against the net. I want to keep in some shit. Give me an eight ball on the river. Give me quads. Ah, shit. This isn't the most ideal scenario, but we are... So we three-bat versus fun player. Get cold four-bat. Uh, just shove in here, I think. Snap by... Can we actually win a flip for once today? What do you mean, nines? King. So retarded. Not only have I not won a single flip, that is not a flip I should be ever, ever, ever be in. That's under the gun versus button versus big blind. He's just stacked off nine. Right, this guy three bets really small from the big blind, and I call, and I'm going to check back on this flop. So his range is most likely going to be pretty nutted, and I just want to realize here and just get to the river relatively cheaply. So even though it seems like a hand like, oh, why would you not bet this hand? You've got loads of equity. I think checking is best. And then no matter what size he bets on the turn, we call, and then we hope to drill. The nine of hearts would be the sexiest one, to be honest, but let's just get there somehow. We've got there somehow. And hopefully he's got aces, which would make a lot of sense. Ace king and doesn't want to fall, which is nice. Ding, ding, fucking ding. Uh, I'm going to over back because I don't. So he check raises and then check calls turn. I think that like, I'm going to have some five, six here that's going to want to bluff. But I don't think his 4x is even going to check raise as well. So, But he always calls. So I think I'm going to over back to get the max from 4x here. Nice. 4-5. King deuce. Sir? What do you mean called forward? I don't know if we call this when we get called forward either. Might be a bit of a punt this call. So all check shoving does is get ace king to fold if he even folds ace king. So I don't know if shoving is even a good thing here. So I guess we just call. And versus check check on, on brick turns, we're gonna have to shove the river. Um, I mean, I am just shoving, though. I've got 10 high. I actually can't have a worse hand here. Does he have a check back with, like... So we can maybe even get ace-king to fold here. Kings as well. Does he check back aces? Does he just bet? I think he just bats aces. 
and queens and jack. I, I really think he should fold ace-king as well. How can I call a four bet and have a worse hand? Ten. A lot of people don't bluff tens. You know. Ace-king with a king of diamonds becomes a bit more awkward because it's hard for me to... No, because I still have queens and jack. And ace-queen. Yeah, I have so much value here. I think this is. I think this is. Uh, I think he should fold Ace King. Can I get sniped here? Is the question. Nice. Ten high, like a fucking boss. Deuces flop sets. Okay, well, I'm not going to raise ever against this size because this guy's a nit, so, like, three betting doesn't really make that much sense. That's a good and a bad card. Now only one combo of fives. Um, but, like, seven five now beats us. <clears throat> so, I'm going to check back here because there's a world where we have 0% equity. It's not the reason why I'm checking back per se. It's more that I want him to catch up with his flush draws now or his 8-6 and stuff, which will all just fold river. I don't think I can raise this. Because what is going to call? King 7? Does that even check raise? I'm just going to call here. Because I think we beat bluffs or, or we lose. I'm so fucking good at this game. I'm so good at this game. It's like a fucking gif. It's like I can't control it. Show me somebody else that's going to lose that amount. That is perfect. Clip this. This is why you don't be a nick, because you can't get value boat over boat. Fuck me. Can I just fold? Let me see a check. Colin, Colin Brex. Losing to ace-queen pretty often here. Or do I just want to shove? If he's got the whale tag, him out of ace-king. Just in case you have some absolute, like, something like sixes or some shit, which seems unlikely, but... Shouldn't we check call and lose to ace-queen? This is the worst hand I'm going to call on river as well. Have some random punt for once. Yeah, nice turn card. Maybe I should just fold flop. That's so fucking nasty, man, against the whale. So fucking retarded, these bots. Jesus Christ, man. That gives himself the fish tag. Makes my life awkward now. Still going to run this. If, if he does have jacks, he's going to fold and stuff as well. Uh, there's a world where he'll just have like eights and nines, although I don't know about this guy having them. Just kings. Okay, you get the nit tag. <clears throat> Maybe I could have folded there. Always like little periods of just fucking getting wrecked, you know? It's never just like... All right, let me just win a stack back with aces, please. Never, always. There's that stain before with the 7-5 suited. So if you four bats, I'll do what I never do in these positions and, and shove. I'm not expecting to get four bat though. We do get four bat. Let's see if this net has four bat bluffs. Of course he doesn't. This happens to everybody. Everybody, this happens to everybody. Absolutely insane. Absolutely fucking insane. This happens to all, all the cash game streamers, though.
Do I want to run it? Because I see Southern River. Problem is if he has King Queen and, and King Tanner Diamond specifically. I think this is okay. There's a world where he falls, actually, this dude. There's a bit of a whopper. Yeah, nice. Uh, 99 roll. 99, 90 roll. <clears throat> Good turn. I'm going to show versus about, though. Should be about in, like, part here. Can I click? I have to raise. Uh, I really don't know what to do. I think I have to raise this on this board. This shoving just feels retarded, though. Fucking no idea what I'm doing in this one. Just have fives. Fives. Even better. Jesus fucking Christ. Moan it in. Christ. Sorry. Three, five off. All right. Interesting spots all across the board. We've got tens. We've got queen jack suited in three back part. Ace king in a single raise part. Ding, ding. Fucking ding. Do I just want to check raise this hands? I mean, they've got all kinds of shit. So maybe. I think jack's four bats from him a lot. What do you mean check back? Yeah. And they can have some, like, A7 and, like, 8s and 5s and 6, 7 suited and shit, so. Obviously, they've just flopped the nuts. 10 or a 6. How am I supposed to, like, fucking play against these type of players, though? How have you got 4 or 5 there and just ram it in? Guys, they got 3, 5 off and just fucking playing for stacks. And then next time just has the fucking flop nuts. Okay. Oh, about me. Unfortunately, I get four bet down here, which isn't what I wanted, but I'm not folding Jack. So we take it down with the aces. Jack. Jack of space. So I've, I'm going to fold Jack sometime. Because I have nines, I have nine eights, and I have aces pure. Because I always three bat and I always call the four bat. Um, and I check those hands as well. So I guess I could bet really small. I think checking is fine as well. Now we have even more hands. We got tens in a splash pot though, which is amazing. He snap checks, which we like. And we win. He should bluff that on turn. He blocks aces and queens, our strongest hand. And he also gets ace king to fold. Tens. We are against Ace Jack. We are flipping. He wants to run it once. <laughs> okay. Ten, please. Can't wait to see my EV grow. Absolutely obscene. Happens to everyone, though, boys. Everyone has run below EV... Uh, every single... Uh, I'm running above EV at 1k, though. I need to get more hands on it. Run below at every stake in my life. And then I started playing higher and I started winning. I started running above EV. I think I need to just move up with the respect, my reason. It's more just sat here just losing every single fucking all-in, regardless of equity, is the most fucking frustrating thing. Look at it. Actually, just fucking look at it. Got back to even as well, which is mega retarded. We were 1k down, got back to even. And then just like ran like absolute fucking shit. Well, that's one and a half buy-ins under EV on ACR and five buy-ins under EV. So we're 1.3k under EV in 1,000 hands, which is just basically what? Bottom 5% session? <laughs>